Ladies and gentlemen, I am Lee Demon Smith, and here joining me, of course, is Joe. He's still alive, Miller, and of course, Sam. That's game! Kobe Hartman Kensler as we head into the last semi final series. It's, I guess, another one. This is going to be an ace in the hole. Doesn't quite get them the ace, though, in the end. Diamond having his It's My Jungle GTFO t shirt on. <laughs> underneath he didn't get to unveil it he didn't get to pull it out we'll see how cool this is this is going to be an interesting one jump on twitter twitter and tell us who you think will win this one hashtag cool or hashtag qtv king of smite steals because he has done it so many times before there's a barrel taking peck it out to half he dodges the kill out of chuck but can he get away from the rest that was a replay i'm <laughs> casting over a replay getting all excited about it Forget all that. Forget all that. When it. destiny has just been used, you have no vision in your jungle. Why do you walk into it? What the hell was that? It was rubbish. That's what it was. Rubbish. Come on, high. Step it up, boy. You're at 171. This is not what we want to see from Cloud9. They should be able to turn and get that, if not an inventory of their own. Are you guys still with me? Yes, we are, we are here. Job. I know it's a great game, but we got two analysts on this one. You've got to help me out here. You saw it at the end. You were saying, hit the damn Nexus one way you're going. That's where he was going. He was chasing the MVP down the lane to get a bit of a bonus kill at the end. Yeah, MVP my ass is what he was thinking. 8-0-7 for Tabs. They need to keep putting damage on the tower. Hit the tower, for Christ's sake. Steal back. I hate that with AD carries. When all their only job in this goddamn game is to hit a turret, and they don't do it. I'm going to change the game considerably. You have a point, actually. If Silva survived, Peggy would have died early as well. So, good point. I, I've been casting for a while. I you have. I kind of, kind of learned the game. Only a little, though. Only, Only a little. little. I mean, I'm not quite LCS pro player level. But then again, neither are you anymore. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> At least I can get out of Bronx. That's all I'll say. <laughs> I am not in any rank, so it's all good. The fact that Kowtod says it doesn't matter. If Gambit are playing their game, they're better than everyone. I'm more sad about the fact that Unlimited isn't a Deficial fanboy. He could have been last season at least. This time around though, he was a Gambit fanboy. And as you said yourself, they are fantastic as a team when they play well and when they want to win. Well, most of the time people do support teams and players that actually win things Deficio. So I can understand <coughs> that one as well. Thank you very much, Quick Shot. And hello, everyone. I am Lee Demon Smith, and sharing the caster desk with me for our final three games is Sam Kobe Hartman Kensler and the one and only Joe. Just call me Joe Miller. <laughs> Thanks for that. That really helps all those uh, Reddit threads out there, which have been going for years now. And honestly, they never get boring. Still got that last chance. They honestly. are three and three in the group right now, and EDG are three and two. So it is in EDG's hands right now to actually just keep in the tournament, let alone anything else. And it's in Samsung White's hands to... I'm not sure really what your point is. <laughs> three and two. Three and two. Yeah, that's three and right. two. No, you're right. You're I am right. right. You got I'm it. Question in my maths. <laughs> it's I uh, never do maths on air. No, or at all, I think, is the, the general <laughs> consensus on that one. But 